Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to easily adjust the direction of your motors using the latest version of SpeedyBiz app, which now supports both BLLES and BLLE32 ESCs. In addition, I'm also happy to tell you that two of you lucky subscribers are going to win this useful adapter, which is going to be directly sent to the winners by SpeedyB, and in case you would like to participate in the giveaway, all you have to do is to leave a comment on this video, make sure that you are publicly subscribed to my channel, and hit the notifications bell, so in case you are the winner, you are not going to miss out. One SpeedyB adapter is going to be given to a random subscriber, and the second one for a random Patreon supporter, so in case you would like to improve your chances of winning this adapter, and also help to support my channel, check out my Patreon page, which is linked down below. The first thing that you need to do is to update SpeedyB's app to the latest available version. You should note, however, that currently adjusting the motor direction is available only in the Android app and not in iOS, and according to SpeedyB, this feature is going to be added to the iOS version soon. In addition, you should note that in order to adjust the motor direction using a BLL32 ESC, you will need to use a flight controller that is flashed with Betaflight version 4.1.6 and above, and on top of that, some combinations of flight controllers and BLL32 ESCs are not working properly, and SpeedyB are working on fixing the related bugs. I'm going to start by showing you how to adjust the motor direction using a BLL ESC. First, connect the flight controller to the SpeedyB adapter 2, power it up, and connect your phone to the generated Wi-Fi network or connect the flight controller directly to an Android device using an OTG adapter. Then open up the SpeedyB app and connect it to your flight controller. After making sure that the propellers are off, head over to the Motos tab, power on the quadcopter, under the motor speed control check I understand the risk switch and test the direction of each motor. In case you need to adjust the direction of a motor, under the motor direction control, BLLE slash BLLES, check I understand the risks, and under this tab, you'll be able to adjust the direction of each individual motor. Once you are done adjusting your settings, don't forget to hit the save motor direction settings button. In order to adjust the motor direction using a BLLE32 ESC, after making sure that the propellers are off and the quadcopter is powered up, head over to the motor direction control, BLLE32 tab, confirm that you understand the risks, and press continue. You should note that once you press continue, the motor direction is going to be reset, and all the motors are going to start spinning slowly. Then you need to touch each motor in order to determine its direction, and in case it needs to be reversed, simply select it in the display chart. Once you are done selecting the motors that need to be reversed, press the selected button, all the motors are going to start spinning again, make sure that they are spinning in the correct manner, and then press the finish button. So overall, in case you need to adjust the direction of your motors, especially when you are on the go, using SpeedyBee's app is a very convenient method that will provide you with an all-in-one solution for both BLLES and BLLE32 ESCs. Keep in mind though that as I mentioned previously, the solution is still not perfect for BLLE32 ESCs, so you might experience some technical difficulties, and if you do, it will be great if you can provide SpeedyBee with some user feedback, as it is going to speed up the developing process. Anyway, that's going to be it for this quick video. I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comment section down below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you like this video and consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notifications bell if you're not already subscribed. See you in my next videos and goodbye.